What's up everyone, my name is Josh and this is Josh Unboxing and welcome back to another video. And today we got ourselves the weekly pickups video. I'm trying to stay a little more consistent with this. Um, previous to this video, you saw my recent um, pickups from a local card show with my son. Um, those cards are not included in here. Um, and previous to that, my last pickups video was a month's worth of stuff. Um, but you know, I'm trying to keep it consistent with the weekly pickups. As you can see, I got a stack of graded cards here and I got a stack of raw cards here. A lot of cards I picked up recently over at Burping Sports Cards and then the rest are, are all here from eBay. Uh, we got a bunch of Kobe graded cards. Um, as you know from one of my previous videos, my current position, uh, my current long-term position uh, with Kobe Bryant rookie cards is just trying to get them in any grade um, if they're at an affordable price. So we're gonna start off with those. Uh, we got a Fleer PSA 8, and we got a Fleer PSA 7. We got a Skybox PSA 8. These are all rookie cards, mind you. Uh, we got uh, another 1996 Kobe Bryant Skybox 8.5. Uh, we got a Z Force 8. And the last one I got here was is a 1996 Stadium Club Kobe uh, PSA 6. And the last uh, graded card that I picked up was a 1981 Topps Magic Johnson. This is a PSA 5. Uh, I think this card here is my next uh, long-term um, target. Uh, in this type of card, I feel like any grade is pretty good. Uh, you can get these lower grades for a really, really good price. Um, I think PSA 8s and PSA 7s of this particular card uh, might make good long-term holds. Obviously, that's just my opinion. Uh, you can even go the same route with uh, the Larry Bird of this set as well. Um, so I'm trying to current. I'm currently trying to figure out what my next long-term position will be. I'm debating on this 1981 Topps Magic Johnson. There's another a couple cards that I'm debating on, the 85 Topps Hulk Hogan, or even the 93 SP Derek Jeter. Um, but, you know, I'm trying to decide where I'm gonna go with it. Um, but those are all the graded cards. Um, these next ones here are cards that I picked up raw. Um, the last two in this lot uh, were eBay. The rest of them were all burping sports cards. Uh, we're gonna start off with this top uh, stack here and these are uh, WWE cards uh, we got two I think these are 2018 tops heritage um, this is Maurice Let me see, is that 2018 it's always so hard to tell 2018 tops heritage Maurice cards um, we got a 2018 tops heritage Stephanie McMahon and we got these I think these are 2018 women's division no, 2019 a women's division Stephanie McMahon cards and a 2015 Topps Chrome Brie Bella. So um, I do dabble in wrestling cards as well. I think when I relaunched this channel, I did a couple of wrestling box breaks. So I, I guess I do look for wrestling cards once in a while, especially if I can get them at good prices. Uh, this next stack of cards are all uh, Mariano Rivera cards. Um, what we got here is, uh, I think this is a 2005 Ultra Gold Medallion. I really like Mariano Rivera. I think, uh, I think like, the greatest closer ever, the only unanimous uh, selection into the Hall of Fame. So I, I really like his stuff. This is a 2001 Topps Chrome base card. We got a, I think this is a 90. No, this is a 96 Fleer Ultra Mariana Rivera rookie card. It says rookie on there. Uh, as you all know, the 1992 Bowman um, is considered his true rookie. But, you know, we got cards here that are denote, that have the notation of rookie on here. So this is the 96 score cards. Got three of them here. Got a 97 Topps Chrome base card. We got a... I believe this is a Topps update. I don't know if this is the Topps update or if this is the, just the base Topps, but this is the 2011 Topps Diamond Anniversary uh, Mariano Rivera. These cards look so nice. Um, you know, just a little off-centered left to right, but it looks really, really good. We got another one here, but this is the, uh, the checklist. Number US 128. And I believe this one might be the Topps update version. Update series, US update series. Uh, we got a, I think this is a 1999 um, or 98 Metal Universe 
I think this is the championship one of Mariano Rivera. We got a, I think this is the 2000 medal Mariano Rivera. And we got a 2013 select uh, Mariano Rivera. I know with the Panini cards, they're not really licensed. Um, so that's why it says New York in here rather than Yankees. But this was a first year select card, so I thought that was uh, pretty cool to get there. Next up, we got a bunch of Derek Jeter cards. Um, first one is a, I think this is a 1995 EXL or 96 EXL. Uh, it's always hard to remember because the years, the basketball years and the baseball years, I get them mixed up. <laughs> but this is a EXL, this is 1996 Derek Jeter. We got a Silver Signature Collector's Choice Derek Jeter. I think this is 94. Yeah, 94. We got a Star Rookie Derek Jeter Upper Deck. I believe this is 94 as well. No, this is 95. We got a um, Upper Deck SE Derek Jeter card. And I think these are 93, 1993. We got a 2000 Metal Universe um, Platinum Portraits Derek Jeter. We got two of them here. We got some more 1994 Collector's Choice Derek Jeter cards. These are 94. And then we got a 1996 Topps Derek Jeter card base. And we got a couple of these 2015 Topps uh, Derek Jeter base cards here so pretty cool card there the next two are Ichiro cards so we got a Starquest gold um, Ichiro which is the uh, rare version the gold rare and then we got a 2005 tops base Ichiro so oh no 2006 sorry <laughs> so you can see those right there we pick it up a lot of um, Hall of Famers, uh, Fringe Hall of Famers. Uh, I think though there's some, there's a lot of value to be had with Hall of Fame players. Uh, these next cards here are all um, basketball cards. We got 2003 Carmelo Anthony. This card. We got a Upper Deck Retro Larry Bird. I believe this is from 99, 1999. We got some. Uh, Will Chamberlain Silver cards. Uh, we got a Will Chamberlain 2018 Prism Silver and we got a 2019 Prism Silver. Got some Bill Russells here. Uh, we got 2018 Bill Russell Silver cards. More 2019 Bill Russell Silver cards. And we got 2019 Bill Russell uh, Green cards. And we got a 2007 Topps Finest uh, Bill Russell. I think this is Durant's rookie year. Got some Jerry West cards here also. Uh, we got a Topps Signature Basketball Jerry West base card, number 2325. Got a 2018 Prism Silver of Jerry West. And we got a 2012 Crusade Blue and Yellow um, Refractor or Prism of Jerry West. And the last two cards are Oscar Robertson cards. We got the 1970 Topps Tallboy. It's okay. I mean, look at that. The corner is kind of is roughed up, but I think it's still a pretty cool card to own. And then we got the 1971 as well, which seems to be better condition-wise in terms of corners. I believe this one has a service issue on it. Centering is a little off too, but I thought those were cards were pretty cool. Uh, these two I purchased off eBay. The rest of these I got off, off of Burbank Sports Cards uh, when I took a recent trip there and just dug through boxes, um, just trying to find cards that were pretty cool, pretty interesting. And then we got a bunch of um, graded cards here. So that's pretty much it. Like I said, I'm trying to be more consistent with these um, so you guys can see what I've been picking up. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't yet, please consider subscribing. And with that being said, my name is Josh, and I'll see you guys in the next video later.